There is no creation, storage, and retrieval of digital information without quantum physics. It's not some other thing that other smart people worry about in the lab. It is with us. We are embedded in it. There right. is no modern industry without it. Yeah, and so, if you were to go back to like 1910 and show somebody an, uh, an iPhone, <laughs> uh, you know, they, they'd burn you at the stake. I yeah, mean. they'd resurrect the witch burning. Yes, they would. And they'd be, yeah, they were like, we were wrong about witches. And, you know. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to say it, and then I want to get Chuck's reaction. There's that, those parts of quantum physics that we need, that we want, that help us in our technologies and our computers and, that, and everything. Then there's the part of the quantum physics that's just kind of floating out there that we have to take seriously because it's, the extensions of what we know works mathematically and conceptually. So now you go to the edge and you explore the edges of those equations. Oh my gosh, you just gave me a whole new freaking universe. And what does that mean? And what is that gonna take us? And I got entanglement and I got all of this. That's why people are taking it seriously because the rest of it works.